Hey guys, so I went to TJ Maxx. I got a bunch of stuff. Still spent every bit of the money I had, but I got a bunch of stuff and I'm so excited. So I want to show you guys what I got. Okay, well the first thing I got, I had to grab this, I'm sorry, it was the Pat McGrath Labs in Bridgerton. This is the Blushing Delights. I, can you guys believe this is at TJ Maxx? Like, yeah, okay, I kind of understand why it's at T TJ Maxx, but I thought she sold out of this because I saw she couldn't, wouldn't ship to the United States. Yeah, like, it said, like, could not ship to the United States, which I don't understand. But I'm excited I got this at TJ Maxx. I only paid $19.99 for it. I did pick up Subculture because this was, like, the last one that they had. <sighs> Brand new. Nothing was broken. I had to pick it up. So I paid $19.99 for it because I want the whole Anastasia collection. Glossier's Solar Paint Luminous Bronzer Cream in the shade Heat. I paid $9.99 for this. This is like a little deep for me, I think, but I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. I can definitely see myself using this. I can see myself using it. Okay, let's see. What next? Okay, I was actually going to purchase this in my Sephora order next year. This is the Anastasia and Norvina Mini Pro Pigment Volume 1. I paid $7.99 for this. Like, why? And they had a few of these, actually, you guys. So why not get something on sale if you're going to pay full price for it? Why not get it on sale? Like, come on. And I kind of like this. Packaging. Okay, I got the Becca Light Shifter Brightening Concealer in 2.5 Gamma Ray. I paid $5.99 for this. And even though I know Becca is, like, no longer in business, um, I don't know. I just wanted to grab it and try it, because why not? It was on sale, obviously. This is the Give Beauty Hella On Point Ultra Fine Brow Pencil. I got mine in the shade 3. I paid $8.99 for this, and I have been wanting to try Give Beauty, so why not give it a try? It was on sale. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot. Let's see... What else did I grab? Okay. Uh, this is for my niece. This is just Disney Princesses. It's a palette. It's got, um, obviously, Beauty and the Beast. It's got Belle on it. She likes, you know, stuff like that. I only paid $4.99 for it. It's a Christmas gift. Why not? Let's see. Oh, I got the Jaclyn Cosmetics Liquid Lipstick in the shade Outspoken. This is, this was $6.99. They had some Jaclyn Cosmetics stuff, but, like, I don't know. I don't know. I just very excited because this looks like a nice shade. I know a lot of people like Jacqueline's lipstick formula. So here is some other stuff I got. Lila B Palette Perfection Eye Quad. I got this for $9.99. It's regular like $35. Okay. So, let's sh I, I'm a little confused as to why this is such a nice heavy box. So you're just gonna, like, I'm gonna throw it away now. And this is, like, such a little product. I was trying to, like, lift this up, and it, it's, like, not lifted up. It's, like, you slide it. This is an say Be Fabulous. Even though I don't like quads like this, I don't have, like, the separations and stuff like that, I am gonna use it, because I know a lot of people like Lila B. So I'm excited to try that, and I'm glad I didn't pay full price for it. Also got the Lila B. Flawless Finish Foundation. Let me see. I opened all of this stuff after I paid for it. Just to make sure it wasn't broken. Because that would suck. How much did I pay for this? This was $9.99 as well. So This is in the shade... This does not have a shade. Be Pure, maybe? I don't know. It's a little deep, but I definitely can make this work. I can definitely make this work. I don't have a lot of powder foundation. So exciting. And like, it feels like really nice. Also picked up this Kevin Aquan Lights Up Sculpt Blush Duo Mini Ornament. And it was $9.99. And it has the blush and highlighter in rose glow and the sculpting powder in medium. Which, who remembers the sculpting powder? So that is exciting. That's exciting. I I know Kevin Aquan's not in like business anymore, but I always did want to try that sculpting powder, the medium one. And now I can, and I didn't even pay full price for it. Last thing, 
was I did pick up the Morphe 3503 palette because I have 3500 and 3502 and I haven't used them. Oh, you guys could see my Wix stuff. Sorry, guys. I had to go to Walmart and get some stuff for Jackson. <laughs> so I was not using 3500 or 3502 because I wanted to have this. So here is 3503. Let me check the price. I paid... $19.99 for it and they had Morphe like I was just looking for like the high-end stuff so as you guys can see I only got some like mostly high-end stuff but I mean like Pat McGrath come on you guys like Anastasia of course and I got like Lila B I got like obviously I got some stuff to try out I'm excited I'm so excited but this was like $150 so I don't know how you guys do full faces but I am excited because I was telling my mom I was like I'm not gonna hoard this makeup I can see myself using this makeup like immediately like I actually have plans to these are like the only two things I don't have plans to like use right away because I do s different lipsticks and I'm really into how I do my brows right now so this is like a backup but other than that, like, I really want to try this. I've really been into cream prom, like, cream products lately. You guys know that. So exciting. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm going to end it here. Go change Kai's diaper, put this makeup up, and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye, y'all.